Hey family, it's the Mobile Home Diva, and in today's video, I'm touring a tiny home. Yes, another tiny home. I think you're gonna love it. So let's get into the video. Touring the Timber Ridge by Woodland Park. This is a tiny home. It's out here at, at Carteret RV in Cedar Point, North Carolina. This is a beautiful tiny home. I'm so excited to show it to you. Before we go on the inside, I'm gonna walk the perimeter. Y'all know these places are always on the side of the road, right? So don't judge me for all the noise. Listen, this home is beautiful. This home is beautiful. Look at all the windows. We got upstairs and downstairs super beautiful can't wait for you to see it you guys so let's get into the video shall we we're gonna go through the side door you got a front door there side doors here look at all the transom windows around the upstairs just really beautiful so let's go ahead and go inside so you can see this home absolutely beautiful we're going to start with the living room area first of all because of the height of this home you got really tall ceilings you've got look at this you've got ceiling fan in here lots and lots of windows you got a lot of space to let a lot of light come in absolutely beautiful i would actually put a couch on this wall so that my TV could hang here and I could watch it comfortably. You've got storage space. Look at all these windows. You can actually, I would put a single chair here and a single chair there. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Love the tray ceiling. Love the detail. You've got can lighting up there. This is a beautiful room and a lot of space. Just a lot of space here. All of these windows open. Really pretty. Gorgeous. Beautiful. I'll go over here so you can see what it looks like to be in the living room and look over into your kitchen area. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So that's the living room. Again, you have sliding glass door there. You can have a curtain there for privacy or you can put a blind up. It's really up to you. And above the sliding glass door, you have a transom window. You can also put bar stools here um, since you don't have space for a table. Or if you get real creative, in addition to the bar stools, you could put a little two-seater table here, depending on what your needs are. I noticed that you also have this cabinet on this side of the counter, and that is for additional storage. So very nice. Very nice. And it's soft clothes. <laughs> Y'all know I love soft clothes. Okay, very good. So your fire extinguisher will go here very nice for safety purposes and then here is your kitchen you guys you've got all of this counter space again you can put a bar stool here and you could put two over here for lots of uh, room for your company you've got one two three four cabinets four drawers and then you've got upper cabinets as well I like the fact that you have space, additional storage space on top of the cabinets. So, hey, your appliances or your pots and pans or even just de decorative items could go up there. But you've got all of this space. All of this space in here. Look, you've got a Lazy Susan in here. I originally said spices. But you could put your spices up here and even have, you could put spices there. It depends on how much you cook, right? 
I probably would have spices and sugar and you know all kind of little things in there because it's certainly a lot of space for it so very good love the soft clothes yes you got can lighting up under here lots of lighting here you guys look you can hang wine glasses here you've got your cabinet space down here and it has except for under the sink this is your under the sink area but these other cabinets have middle shelving which is really nice and then you have your drawers over here really and these two on the bottom are super deep so very nice love the sink too y'all i love the black mat i love um the sturdy sink uh faucet that comes with it absolutely beautiful love it love the window over the sink this is a beautiful kitchen beautiful 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 home love this kitchen now in the past i toured a tiny home that didn't come with a stove but these are actually zoned for stoves this one has a stove and a built-in microwave up there so that's great then you've got a full refrigerator over here and additional storage pantry storage over here for your pots pans um pantry item foods you've got these drawers that pull out on the bottom like what more do you need you guys you got two drawers that pull out on the bottom very nice love it and they're soft clothes as well and then you have the additional storage uh drawers hit cabinets here and additional storage up there so really lovely really lovely how nice is this kitchen i'm gonna go back around the counter space and let you get another view of the kitchen don't mind my camera equipment really nice We've seen the living room here, and then we've seen the kitchen. Beautiful. So let's go take a look at the rest of the house. We'll save the bedroom for last. You got stairs here. This is the, I don't know if this is the front or the back door. I guess it really depends on you. I say front door. You got your front door here. You got blinds in there that close. I don't know how to work it, but those blinds close for privacy. And then when you come in the front door, you got stairs here and a bathroom there. So we'll save that for last. We're gonna go up the steps. So this is your loft slash second bedroom. Now you can't stand, I can't, I'm bent over. But this would totally be my bedroom. You've got that loft area up there. Nice wide space. Big enough for a king size bed. You got a little cubby over there. So you could totally put like a little nightstand and a little light. Or you could put it on this side. It's really up to you. You have, you've got outlets up here. Well, I see one over there so you do have an outlet up here you've got a transom window right there so you're able to get natural light in the daytime this is absolutely gorgeous up here you guys absolutely love it again i am in carteret at carteret rv in cedar point north carolina beautiful this is storage i can't get to it because these boxes are here. But I see a drawer pulls out from here. A drawer pulls out there. So you've got this area and you've got that area over there. And then all of this loft space here for what you want to do. You've got a closet here. You can hang items up. Really nice. Really nice really nice i'm gonna go back down a little bit 
so you can see this area. Excuse the boxes. This house has to be set up and those are additional items. You guys tore homes yourself so you know how it is. I just wanted to give you a general look of what this space looks like. So really nice. Okay, very good. So we are going, I'm actually backing down the stairs because of how I was. <laughs> I love this. I would totally live in this house, you guys. So again, that's your stairway. Really nice uh, railing, sturdy. I absolutely love it. More can lights in the hallway. Across from the front door is the bathroom. Let's see if we got lights. Do we have lights? No lights, but you can see in here. You got your toilet and sink there. The sink is cat corner. Gives you more counter space. You got your cabinet under the sink two shelves which is really nice so you have lots of space in your bathroom and then this is a medicine cabinet type feel love it because look at all the space that you have for your personal items in addition to these mirrors for you to get ready you also have the space here so look at all this space you have for your personal items as well it's under the cabinet. Really nice. Love it. Love all these mirrors. Like, it leaves no question to what I need to do. More can lights under there. You got a shower. Nice walk-in shower. Something, some, something is keeping it from opening. Probably because of what, how they tie it down to move it. But this is a nice shower. You've got a space for your shampoo or soap what have you here you've got your shower head up there hope you can see it really nice and then you've also got storage space over here and these cabinets actually have three sections really nice lots of storage under your stairway you have even more storage here you've got cubby holes there i see shoes and book bags and I don't know whatever you need so much storage space in here really nice so that is your restroom and then the last room we need to see is this I call this the master however you could live upstairs or downstairs really nice now you walk down into this bedroom so it's two steps down this looks like a queen. It might be a king. Huge, huge bed in here. It looks comfortable too. I'll open one of the cabinets so you can see. You have storage. You have three sections. You have a nightstand on either side of the bed. And these plugs have the plug as well as the USB. And this looks like a little nightlight. Is what that looks like. Really lovely. Really lovely. Can lights in here. You've got a huge window for lots of natural light. You've got space for your TV up there. You've got one, two, three, four, five, six drawers. And then you have closet space on either side and drawer space down here. How nice is that? How nice? Y'all let me know how you like this tiny home. Like, come on now. This home is the bomb. Isn't it? This home is the bomb. For privacy, they got it locked in and I can't show it to you. That's okay. They have to move this home when you purchase it. But this slides over and shuts. So you got a door for privacy. How nice is that? really lovely so let's talk about the price and some details on this home wasn't this home beautiful all right you guys i'm out here at carteret rv in cedar point north carolina again this home is the timber ridge it's made by woodland park absolutely beautiful home there's all kind of options here for furniture packages this home comes with the stove and microwave this particular home if you buy this 
home price. It does not, the price that I'm gonna quote you, there is a separate AC package. If you're interested in any details, please make sure that you contact Greg at Carteret RV. His information will be in the description box. Now for this home, home only price, is uh, $119,685. It'll be on the screen. And if you're interested in adding the AC package through Carteret RV, you can contact Greg, okay? All right, I hope you enjoyed this tour. Let me know how you feel about this home in the comment section, and I'll see you in the next video.